Thanks a lot, Catherine, and good afternoon, everyone. Uh, thank you very much, Catherine, uh, Alex, and the M2E team for inviting eBay to speak about managed payments this afternoon. Um, so this afternoon, I will be providing a little bit of an overview of our managed payments journey. Uh, what does it mean when eBay manages payments, key customer changes that will be involved, and some next steps. So what does it mean um, when eBay says that we're getting involved in payments and why are we getting involved in payments? So payments is the foundation to enable customers to shop the world on eBay. Uh, it gives us a lot of flexibility as uh, commerce e continues to evolve. And we see more and more that buyers aren't necessarily always doing their purchasing on eBay sites. Distributed commerce is becoming more and more relevant and buyers want to shop and, and discover new new places uh, that uh, uh, discover things in, in different places that gives them the flexibility to um, to really uh, drive at different experiences. So as payments and shopping and, and commerce continues to evolve uh, by driving the, the payments experience into when it gives us a lot uh, more opportunity to play in different spaces and very much stay at the f at the forefront of innovation. Uh, it also allows us to expand our reach into new markets and also into new segments like high ASP and of course introduce new methods of payments. So we're making great progress. Um, as of the end of Q1 2020, we have processed $3 billion of um, sales, as well as having more than 32,000 sellers on board on the platform already. Our journey in managed payments uh, really started uh, almost two and a half years ago when we announced uh, in January 2018 our intention to play in a different role in payments. In September 2018, uh, we launched our first offering to our sellers in the US and we've continued to iterate on this experience. We've introduced incremental forms of payments in, 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 in the form of Apple Pay, Google Pay and of course uh, PayPal. And in September 2019, we launched in our first European market, Germany. And this year, we've announced that UK will be our next European market, as well as Australia and Canada. And we will continue to as well continue to ramp in Germany and the US. Our intention is that we'll continue to roll out this experience all the way across eBay marketplaces to largely be complete globally by the end of 2021. So what does it mean when eBay manages payments? In the most simplest terms, uh, buyers have more ways to pay, including their existing forms of payments, credit card, debit card, and PayPal. And they also have uh, the opportunity to use new forms of payments like Apple Pay and Google Pay. eBay manages the payment transaction, so buyers pay us directly. And sellers can sell and get paid all in one place on eBay and will be paid directly to their bank account uh, at a frequency that they can choose, which is currently either daily or weekly. And we'll consistently initiate payments, payouts, sorry, to their bank account within two business days of an order confirmation, regardless of how the buyer is paid. So what Managed Payments really does is simplify the end-to-end -end, uh, user experience for our customers, for our buyers, our sellers, and our developers and partners like M2E. For our buyers, uh, we just simply want them to have the option to pay with whatever is familiar to them in their everyday life. Uh, we also want this um, experience to be really simple and intuitive with as few steps as, as possible. And we know that buyers aren't coming to eBay to think about payments. They're coming to really find the thing, next great thing that they're looking for and uh, purchase it and receive it as, as soon as possible. For our sellers, uh, you guys today, you have to manage your business on eBay in two places. For listings and conversions for your sales, you come to eBay. 
everything post that sale, uh, you have to also interact with uh, PayPal today and to understand where that payment is and where the funds movements are. So there's really two sets of policies, two different customer service organizations, and it's not really the most uh, seamless experience or, or straightforward experience for you to manage on a day-to-day -day basis. And for our partners, it also means an experience often in, in duality of two different sets of APIs that they need to integrate with uh, in order to provide services just for the eBay marketplace. So we're really looking forward to providing a much more simpler experience. At a high level, uh, this is a, a, a view of how it works. For the buyer, uh, they simply come to the site and as they do today, they browse, they select their item and eBay will show the forms of payments that are relevant um, for them based on what market that they're, that, that they're in. They'll pay directly to eBay and what they see on their statement for their credit card or their forms of payments will, um, will also denote eBay so they understand who they're transacting with. Uh, they will uh, receive a confirmation that their order has been placed from eBay and um, as, as they do today, they, they will receive the, the item. On the seller side, they'll list the item on eBay as they do today um, and they'll receive an instant notification from eBay when the item is sold. And uh, this is a signal then for them to ship the item. They'll receive payouts directly from, from eBay. And as I mentioned, either from on a daily or a weekly basis of their choice. And it's simply a single place for them to manage their business. So what are the key benefits for sellers? So in summary, um, managed payments simplifies the buying and selling experience on eBay by delivering multiple benefits. And in terms of choice, there are more payment options that they can offer to buyers. Uh, the existing payment options as well as new payment options I've mentioned. It's more convenience, the single source for customized reports, fees, uh, refunds, and all the post-transaction processes that you deal with today. It's a more streamlined operation, so payouts are directly into the seller bank account. The unique order ID which we introduced last year will continue and it can be leveraged for ease of reconciliation throughout the transaction. Uh, there's expanded reach, so if you currently use global shipping program, you can continue to use that on managed payments. And in terms of reports, we'll also be introducing uh, new payments reports through new payments reports, which you can access and download via Seller Hub in either PDF or CSV formats. And this will allow you to reconcile your transactions and records on eBay, and it will go back seven years in line with tax requirements. From an API integration point of view, um, sellers who integrate using eBay APIs can update uh, their integrations to view payout information as well. So what are the key customer changes? Um, registering for managed payments is, is the first step. Uh, a select number of UK sellers have already been invited to register for managed payments from April 16th. Uh, we are inviting sellers whose features and tools usage is compatible with managed payments in the first instance. And when you come um, to the eBay site and you're asked to, to register, you'll be asked for a couple of pieces of uh, information. And the information required is no different to when you registered for PayPal or other marketplaces. So it includes validation of your eBay account details that you provided at registration, confirmation of seller identity, business information and bank account information. Now, once you've registered, we'll send you further details on preparing uh, your business for managed payments. We will only activate um, you on managed payments starting from late July. Uh, so before then, nothing changes, you can continue to operate as you currently do on eBay. In terms of key product changes, uh, from a listing perspective, there's no need to provide your, um, a payment method for managed payments. And from a payout perspective, you can select scheduled payouts, either daily or weekly on Sellhub. 
And from a refunds perspective, uh, we know that this is a key pain point for sellers today. You can uh, now on managed payments initiate refunds on the platform. You can initiate partial refunds or multiple refunds on a single line item, and you can refund up to 100% of the order. So, and post transaction, uh, this is one of also a key pain point. Now you can manage your disputes on one platform. And in terms of fees, it's a simplified fee structure. One final value fee consisting of a category based percentage of the total amount of the sale plus a fixed fee per order with no third party payments processing fees. Final value fees will be automatically deducted from sellers uh, sales proceeds and the rest will be paid out to your bank account. In terms of next steps, uh, as, as we mentioned, we plan to be ready to start uh, migrating sellers on a phased basis from towards the end of July. And uh, we understand M2E will also be integrated by them. And just a summary of key next steps. Uh, we do ask you if you have had an invite to go and register by 15th of July on payments tab in, in Seller Hub. Uh, we'll notify you before activating your account on managed payments, as I said, starting in late July 2020, and nothing will change in how you manage your business on eBay until then. So do look out for emails from eBay over the next few weeks. There'll be more information coming on how to get started on managed payments very soon. And that's it. Thank you very much.